What's up guys, Twin Gaming Josh here with my first episode of the Everton Career Mode. I know I started um, a new um, West Ham Career Mode which I didn't really upload. That is because, um, actually I can't remember what it was because something was to save the file or something just didn't save and it put me out back to the start of it so I didn't really want to continue with that. Because I had to, because I would have had to start the whole thing again. And starting the same thing again would have really bored me. It probably would have bored you guys as well. So I decided to go with a new club. The team I nearly chose to do my first pre mode on, but I chose West Ham. So we're going to do Everton. Um, as you see me do all my stuff, um, I'll just talk to you about like the goals. You, you'll see eventually in the video, Everton have a, pretty, a really good team. Lots of young players. And eventually it gets to the point in this episode where I just, I, I have to... There's some players I want to really want to train, but I just can't train because right now because I have so many other players I want to train. So we have Barkley, Stones, Funes Mori, and um, Besic, Lukaku. They're all young, play promising players. And so eventually, when you see the signings you make an episode, we sign a, we sign a, um, a few two young players. So it really doesn't it really doesn't help because now we've got like seven, eight young players every like. 10 players I really want to train and I can't train all of them to where I want them to be at the end of the season but I will and probably in the next episode give you um, indications as to where I want players to grow so as you can see we did take the third um, pre-season tournament because it gave us seven million pounds from it so um, well, as you can see now we do um, you'll see me um, being um, changing up the squad a tiny bit that, that is because um, I downloaded the latest updates and it's not like this. I don't have the strongest team out. So I'll just pull that out now while you guys um, see me do it right now. We do obviously put Romelu Lukaku in, Morales, Delefeu. You see all of them in. I do decide to play Delefeu on the right because for me, I have an ultimate team. I think I used to, actually, I used to have him on the team, but he's, best, he's like, I can tell already his best position is right midfield, not left midfield. So um, yeah, we did. We do decide to play. Um, eventually, you'll see. Us, um, this, I'm going. i um, choosing McCarthy over Barry and um, Besic. That's so perfect because it's high rated, and he's. Um, he's. Uh, I know Besic is really young, and if I get the chance to train him, I will train him. So he grows to like 77, 78 by the end of the season. That's kind of my hopes for him. But I don't. Have, I wouldn't have much time to train him because I'll be training other pe players. To get to like 80 rated so we do change the team around put Kone in we obviously need a striker on the bench we do um my what i was looking to buy was a new center uh, a younger center midfield a promising player center midfield and girls is going to go to absolute tank but it doesn't always have to start every game but probably will so you you will see us we do it we do it we try to do exactly that going into the transfer market and trying to sign um Bazor from um, Ajax, who have a lot of young players, and this is one of them. He's 18 years old. 18 year old has the um, I'm pretty sure the showing great potential um, status or something like that, or potential to be great. I don't know something like that. So we do offer Gibson. Sorry, um, loyal Everton fans, but um, he 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 was growing a little bit old. He wasn't really going to grow, and I didn't really have any intentions for him, considering that Everton have so many central midfielders. See, that's the one point I could play Naismith. Barkley, Barry, Besic. Um, if when if we do sign Basel, that'll be Basel as well. Tom Cleverly, someone I quite like as well. Um, obviously you do see that we win the first preseason game three-one, good against Monaco from from France. Um, then we actually then we actually do complete the signing of Basel, our first signing of the season. And we do we put him straight into the team. But I might not stay like that for the whole season, but because uh, I do really want to try cleverly out because I've heard great things for, about him. Um, for the former Manchester United player sold him because they didn't play him, so I really don't kind of don't want to do that, do be like that. But I, I, he will definitely get playing time off the bench um, and starting most starting some games. Yeah, but Baz was only one rating lower. Has the um, Showing great potential when when you click on his training, so he will grow to be like 87, 88, 89, maybe even 90 rated. I don't know. <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm not quite 100% sure what his potential is, but we do draw the second game of preseason 2-2. So 
um, not the best, not, uh, it's a decent result, we're still in second place, so we will be going through, first, tomorrow's well, first place doesn't really matter in this competition, because it is, uh, I'm pretty sure it's random when you get first or second, but I'm 100% sure, so we do reject all offers for, um, Coleman and Lukaku, because they're two of my favourite players in this team, and I really want to keep, we do get into our first training session, to be honest, not really a good, great one, not, hundred not really really bad but it's not the best so um yeah approaching the game against Inter so I might as well tell you now the the, the goals the board gave me at the start of the season they gave me to finish the semi-finals get to the semi-finals of the domestic cup and um, finish fourth or fourth or higher in, in the Premier League which basically means qualifying for the Champions League um, I think we can do it, but um, it's quite hard tasks considering um, I'm only in the first season. But I will at least, at very least, try to get Europa League football because they're, we're not going to have it this year because um, Everton obviously finished, I think, 11th last year. So it's kind of a really disappointing season. But um, yeah, we do go in for Jack Butland. I did go in for Testagen earlier, but I just didn't want to put out a video because there's no point. But, um, because we didn't get him. But that wraps up. We do actually sign Butler. And that wraps up the end of the video. Twin Gaming Josh out.